I'm Christina, and this is my colleague Steios. As you can see, we strongly believe in green energy. But the bad thing is that nearly all our clean technologies contain a variety of critical metals. Most of these metals are coming from mines in China, and this dependence makes us fragile. That's why we are looking for a new, eco-friendly alternative, and we found one. You know what this is? No? This is the industrial waste of zinc production. In most cases, this sludge is stored in a huge landfill because there are no economic solutions yet to fully valorize this waste. But this stuff still contains interesting metals like indium, germanium, and also large volumes of interesting minerals. In our research project called Socrates, we develop new methods to recover the critical metals in such a way that also the minerals can be reused. This is a major challenge because the new methods have to be really eco-friendly too. That means we use no toxics and we target a zero waste approach. By the way, we focus on recovering four critical metals, those here, and some economically valuable metals these ones. Cool, right? The concentrations of metals in the industrial waste, like the sludge, are rather low, but the streams are enormous. And there are many different kinds of waste streams, like tailings from the copper industry, slugs from the non-ferrous industry, and bottom ashes from the incinerators in Europe. Imagine how much we can recover for the future clean tech applications. And when the metals are out, we transform the remaining minerals into an eco-friendly cement. This stuff is ideal for that. With this eco-friendly cement, we will build bricks for the houses and the streets of tomorrow. Sounds crazy, but we can. These young researchers of Socrates are working hard to make it happen. It's time to make this step towards a zero-waste society. Thank you for watching. Bye! Bye.